Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is SNA Siri and in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you my Shein haul. So this is going to be a Shein summer try on haul and if you're ready uh, let's get into it please if you love this video you enjoyed it make sure to give this video a thumbs up i do um, haul videos i do lifestyle videos about my life in london and occasionally i do tv and movie series recommendations and review all right so make sure to hit that subscribe button if these are contents that you're interested in and share my video the first piece that i got is this a lover print not hem blouse oh my god guys i love this blouse this blouse is brilliant it's giving me safari vibes and if you know me if you're watching my channel you know that brown is my absolute favorite color i love it because it has like this tight detail at the hem and at the back i'm just gonna bring this close it's got like this elastic band so it kind of gives you like a bomber jacket vibe i think it's slightly oversized i would have definitely done well with the medium so the next item that i got was also because of this blouse guys so i decided to get some um nude shorts Ooh, guys these shorts are amazing on the website it's called the solid button fly shorts this one i've already launched actually i i paired both of them together and it was an absolute banger i got this in a size 0xl the waist fit perfectly i'm not gonna lie on the model it was a little bit loose on me it was snug but i don't mind it if i was going to get shorts again from shein i'll most likely get a 1xl the fabric is kind of like linen and it's see-through so you might want to wear something underneath if you're not comfortable see this season i'm all about color and i got these shorts actually they're not shorts they're skirts so it's all this short skirt stuff oh my god guys when i saw it on the model i was like i gotta get it i gotta get it i gotta get i gotta get it i love it i love this ring detail i love the straps for this particular skirt i got it in a size 0xl and a 1xl just because i wanted it to not be too tight and um, the 0xl was kind of snug um while the 1xl was too large around the waist but in any case i'm gonna be keeping the zero xl or both of them i think it depends on what i want to wear it with this short actually inspired the next piece that i bought and that is this floral print shirt dress guys oh my god guys this is brilliant and now can you see the reason why i got them like ah i love it this it's a shirt dress it's like an oversized shirt dress and I'm really trying to fit the whole thing in the camera it's not just doing it justice this shirt dress is brilliant although for a dress it's kind of really short so of course I had to when I actually wore it in Manchester I actually wore some shorts underneath it but I was very comfortable it's very oversized with the sleeves if it, it's giving me like kimono vibes I love the print I think this is a dupe from something um, that I seen in Zara and <laughs> she in she in they're always duping Zara stuff, and so it is another shorts guys I got some denim shorts no you know for your summer haul you just need to get yourself some nice faded denim shorts the fit is great but not like how the, it looked on the I think model. for these for jean shorts probably next time i'm probably gonna go for a 1xl and then just use a belt to hold the waist i think that's a safer bet with the shorts i wanted a casual look nothing too fancy schmancy so i got myself a t-shirt um i'm a lover of t-shirts there's nothing really special about it aside from the fact that green is my favorite color and i felt like it just paired really well with the shorts it was just giving me like full-on chill vibes like if i was going on a road trip and i wanted to be absolutely comfortable or traveling i definitely just wear t-shirt and jeans so that was kind of like the inspo for this look another top or blouse that i got is this black and white gingham crop top oh my god guys i love it this one i was very very unsure about the size so i got this in a size large and a size extra large 
and sadly guys neither of them fits like the, it was too tight around the boobs like literally if i was to carry someone's baby up i wouldn't be able to even lift my arms but but sadly i'm going to have to return both of them just because it's that tight and that takes you to my next item which i also paired with this gingham um, blouse is this black shorts so this one's literally it looks like cheap quality because it has like this shiny fabric and um, again similar issue with all the shots that i got it's not giving me that flared look that i really really that i was hoping to go for with this haul um however i like it i love the detailing i like the pleats it's really nice another piece that i got oh this one is like their collaboration piece so i know she in collaborates with like some influencers or designers and this one is with daisy d-a-z-y um, it's this lovely lilac blouse guys. I think what made me buy it was the sleeves I loved this drawstring vibe this band thing and Again, I went with the measurements on the website Which didn't exactly do me so well because on the model it looked really oversized on me It wasn't that oversized, but I couldn't allow this this lovely color go to waste so i decided to style it in a more chic way so i decided to leave the buttons open and pair it with my black shorts and a tube the tube that i'm wearing that i actually paired it with are these ones i actually got them from Shein as well i think they're they're just like a basic tube anyway guys i don't know how to show you this blouse on camera but of course you're gonna see like the clip where I'm, I'm wearing it and it is amazing guys this one is my absolute fave in the entire haul after that um, mustard skirt I love it like it's open on the side and then it's just like I don't know how to explain this blouse it is a complicated twist blouse but it's really really nice the fabric is super thick well not like thick thick but i think it's nice like i think it's perfect for summer anyway the, this was actually the first thing that i saw on shein's instagram page and i was like you know what i'm going to shein's website to go and shop i love this high low top of course i'm not doing this justice but it's beautiful and i i just love this detailing with the buttons like the colorful buttons the only issue i have with this one is i think the sleeves are too long so i've just decided that when i'm wearing them i just turn them up or wear them as is i can also wear it with a short if i wanted that very chic summer vibe show my legs and all of that i love the color it's it's just a very nice orange color that actually suits my skin tones i wanted to get some dresses um and i've been seeing all these summer dresses in my head i'm thinking eventually i'm going to go to greece so i want to have those dress moments you know slow-mo vibes which inspired me to get this dress this dress was disappointing i can't even lie i hate it hate is an understatement like the fabric in real life in person looks really cheap and it's see-through and i don't know it was just giving me grandma vibes like <laughs> my boobs was not having it it wasn't as relaxed as it was on the model am i am i overreacting guys let me know i feel like this style is nice it's like a full-on wrap dress i feel like with a different print it would have made so much more sense but this print is not just working for me so i got this lovely dress i love it because of the slit i think the slit for me is what sold it it is not see-through it is very lightweight material i like the tie detail at, at the bust area i like the i love 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 me some puffy sleeves so i think like just the little details the sleeves the neck the band i really love that band that just defines the waist and the slit is what sold it for me i'm not too crazy about the print but i think i can live with it so yeah that's why i'm gonna keep this one i also got some accessories i got these shades guys oh oh michelle i'm going to finish this video with these shades i love it i feel like 
this shade is like completing the whole summer vibes for me it is beautiful i've been seeing a lot of people wear like these colorful shades and i was just like i gotta get i gotta get it i got to get i got to get it yeah okay <laughs> i'm gonna stop and then i copped this um really cute raffia bag is it raffia we call this i don't know but you get the gist this bag is so cute the only thing i wish this bag had was a longer strap i don't know if you guys can tell but like when i wear it i really like my bag going a little bit lower so this one doesn't go all the way down but i don't mind it at all and of course throughout all the styling you guys saw me wear these sandals the gladiator sandals um i know gladiator was like so yesterday but for me in particular i love them i got them in a size 42 which is my actual size so big ups to Shein for not messing that up <laughs> so what i can say about Shein footwear is that you may want to size up it depends on what the footwear is looking like so if i was ever going to buy shoes from Shein, i'm definitely going to go for the 43 i think i'm much safer buying a 43 than a 42. all right guys bye <laughs> Woodstock free vibes, homie.